everyone welcome to today's video i haven't talked to you guys in so long i feel like i haven't picked up the camera in a little over a week now and i've missed you guys so just wanted to kick off this video say hi but most importantly i wanted to say thank you so freaking much honestly for the amount of support and love and just sweet comments i got on the last video that i posted to be honest i was a little bit nervous to post that video um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I basically posted a video saying that I don't know where I want to take my channel. I'm struggling a little bit with YouTube and that I just was kind of lost in the world of making videos. And everyone in those comments were... Everyone were? Everyone was. Everyone was so nice. And I just am like so grateful. Um, I... I don't know it reminded me of just like why I started this channel in the first place and at the end of the day this is gonna get deep for a second but at the, end, at the end of the day the whole point in me making videos in the first place was to connect with people from like human to human to just have that interaction to connect and I love that part of YouTube and the comments in that comment section were so unbelievably supportive and loving and compassionate and it just reminded me of how remarkable this group of people on this little corner of the internet are and um i am just like so grateful reading through those comments it were it why can i not talk they were the nicest comments i've ever received and i just want to say thank you because i know that sitting on you know that side of the screen that you guys are on it can be very easy to be like well why can't you just like post a video or like it's not that hard you know like stuff like that but i feel like people really truly understood where i was coming from and what i was trying to say so i just wanted to say thank you um my plan going forward is really just like to pick up the camera when i want to which like right now i was like i cannot wait to just catch up with you guys chat with you guys say thank you and vlog whatever i really feel like vlogging today um i also have a amazon lululemon dupes video coming soon i did one of those a while ago and people seem to really really like it so doing another one of those soon i also wanted to do like a christmas present wrap with me and i feel like i'm finally getting a little bit inspired again i don't want to keep to a schedule like i'm not going to say i'm uploading you know x and x a week or three times a week or one time a week I just don't know what that's gonna look like so I'm sorry if the consistency of uh, my videos in terms of like frequency and whatever that looks like is off but I'm just trying to find my mojo again um, if you do follow me on TikTok, I am doing vlogmas over there so I have been posting every single day on there but I know not all of you follow me over there so just wanted to put that out there say thank you and say that your support does not go unnoticed so with all that being said i am in my car because i am parked in the um, nail salon parking lot i need to get my nails taken off i've had these dip for way too long they are so grown out it's driving me nuts i'm not gonna get um like a manicure i'm just gonna get them removed because christmas is in a couple weeks and then right after christmas i'm going on a cruise for like eight days so i'd rather have a fresh set or a fresh manicure then and i don't want to get my nails twice like done twice in the next two weeks i just feel like that's excessive so i'm just gonna get them taken off it'll honestly probably be good for my nails to have a break because i've had dip consistently for like over a year now it's been a while so excited to have these off and then i also wanted to run to target um i want to get stocking stuffers for yusuf so i want to do that and then i think after that i'm pretty much done with all of his presents so i'll be wrapping that soon which i love wrapping presents i can't wait and then also i'm just running you through my day right now but also um we have our wedding cake tasting box getting delivered today in like 45 minutes i completely forgot and then i just got a message from the guy saying he was 40 minutes away and i was like oh i'm not home but yusuf's home so we have that coming today i don't know if i'll include that in this video or maybe i'll do a separate video or maybe i won't film it i don't know but I can't wait. I'm so excited. And yeah, that's what my day is looking like. So let me go into the nail salon. I'm literally just gonna like run in and get these and then run out. So I will pick up the camera when I am going to Target, probably, maybe. It's the next day. I just made my coffee. If you know what this mug is in reference to or from, please comment down below. But it's actually, what time is it? 1.18 p.m., which nuts how 
fast this morning or day has been going so far. I slept until like nine. I stayed in bed till like 9.30, almost 10, which is shocking for me, but I was just so exhausted this week. I have been so insanely tired. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the holiday season. I've just been busier. My best friend was also in town for a week. So I've just been so tired. Um, so I slept in and then I went to the gym, came back, showered. I just blew out my hair, which it's looking a little interesting. But now we're here. I wanted to show you what I did end up picking up from Target yesterday for um, use of stocking stuffers or stocking stuffers for him. And then I got him just like a few other gifts that aren't really stocking stuffers, but I'm just gonna wrap them and put them under the tree. Um, I have also gotten the rest of his gifts, but I think I'm gonna do a whole separate video showing what I got him and also wrapping that. So that will be coming soon. But in the meantime, I didn't end up filming anything else yesterday because I was so busy. I feel like I was running around like crazy and I just didn't have time. And then we went out to dinner with my parents pretty last minute. So that was that, but now we're here. Um, let's go through this. First, I have a couple things for Sully. Fun fact, today is actually Sully's birthday, which is crazy. He's three, which is like very sad because I don't want him to get old. I know three is very young still, but still it's just, he's like my first baby. Like I had dogs growing up. My parents still have dogs that I consider my dogs too, but Sully was like my dog. Like I got him on my own, you know what I mean? So he's my child. Um, I have a cake that I made for him, actually like a little dog cake. So we're gonna do that with him later. But I got him a few things for Christmas. Some dental chew bones, cause it's that dog's breath. Not the best. Some more dog treats, whatever. Oh, I got some stuff for his birthday, but I think that's all done for Christmas so far. Then getting into the stocking stuffers, there's a few things in here that are not stocking stuffers. So just do with that what you will. But. I got each of us a loofah. Um, I'm gonna put this in his stocking because the day, actually on Christmas night, we're driving to Fort Lauderdale to go on a cruise the following day. And so I figured it'd be nice to have some like travel friendly stuff for the cruise. So I got us mini loofahs. I'm gonna end up just bringing this one. And I thought that would be good to put in his stocking. Then I got him a Toblerone giant bar. He is like the biggest fan of Toblerone ever. He's the one who introduced it to me and he loves it. As soon as he like sees anything in this shape, I mean, it's always Toblerone, but like he can spot this from a mile away. If it's wrapped, he knows exactly what it is. Then a few just like toiletry things. I got him this Touchland um, hand sanitizer. It was in like the stocking stuffer area in the um, like cosmetics type area in Target. And people really seem to like this hand sanitizer. So thought that would be good just to have, but also to bring on the cruise. I got some, um, like wet wipes type stuff just to throw in a stocking these couple things are not for him these are for me um, I got the elf tinted what my words are not working today the elf wow brow tinted gel because I ran out of that and then I've seen a lot about this elf brow lift so I wanted to try it I got it with a spoolie so we'll see how that is maybe I'll try it tomorrow I got Yusuf some gummy multivitamins he loves anything gummy related some Cetaphil, we both use this face wash, so a gift for him, a gift for me. Mouthwash for the cruise, some wrinkle release spray. I honestly don't even know if this works, but figured it'd be nice to have on the cruise if, I don't know, just thought it'd be good. Um, some body wash and shaving cream. Some liquid IV, I got the watermelon flavor. I don't think he's ever had this flavor, but I feel like he would like it, and he really likes liquid IV, so. I thought that'd be like a fun little addition in a stocking you probably won't be expecting. Um, some Q-tips. I got some gum. I got him a decent amount of food stuff because he's quite the foodie. Um, these milk chocolate covered peanut butter pretzel nuggets. Those are like his favorite things ever. Trader Joe's has their version, which is I think where he first tried them. And he's loved them ever since. So I got him those and then two bags of Smart Sweets. My hair is not doing any favors for me today. I do not like it. I got my sister a birthday card because her birthday is coming up at the end of December. And then I feel like I'm missing, maybe not. Oh, I also got him some gummy bears. The, uh, what are they, Haribo? No. What's that brand that's like really known for like specifically their gummy bears? I forget what it is. I might remember while I'm editing, but it was in like the shape of a candy cane, like candy cane filled with that. I got him those, but he saw that yesterday. So he asked if he could have it early. So I already gave those to him and they're already finished, I think. Um, then I got him this shirt because I thought this would be cute. He loves a good like button down and I love a button down when it's short sleeve and has buttons going all the way down instead of just a polo. So got him this one. 
I don't know. I like always pick out shirts for him and I feel like he tends to like them. So I thought that was a safe bet. And then he's also been super into golfing as you guys know. So, okay. I got him this, um, it's like a all in motion brand. So it's more of like an athletic type shirt. And it's just a polo, it has palm trees. Thought it was fitting for Florida. And it's um, gonna be good for golf, like I said. And then I grabbed him these swim trunks. I hate this lighting. I do. I'm just so washed out. I just turned that light off because I just, this lighting is driving me nuts. I feel like I'm so washed out. But anyway, yeah, got him these swim, swim trunks. I think he'll like them. They're just like a navy patterned type fabric. So that's all I got for him for stocking stuffers. I do have one thing that's coming in Amazon. It said it was delivered, but I couldn't find it in the package room. But it's this um, like slime that is sticky. And so I've seen people like use it specifically for their car because they can kind of like use it around their car and it'll collect all the dust and stuff. I found it originally on TikTok and I feel like that's something he would really like. So I got him that, I'm realizing right now, there's also shot wipes I got him to travel with. So that's everything for stocking stuffers. I'm gonna grab the wrapping paper and then we'll get wrapping. I love wrapping presents, fun fact, it's like my favorite thing ever. It's a little sneak peek of, well, not really, but I have his Christmas presents here. But I'm gonna grab this. So I have this giant, um, like, no bag. I don't know, I guess organizer for all of my wrapping stuff. And this year I got two new, oh my God. Wait, what? These were in the, Yusuf already wrapped my presents and I think he, I don't know what is going on here because this was all in those pockets. So anyway, um, I got a new or a few new wrapping papers for this year from Costco. So I have this gold one, this one that has like poinsettias, and then this one that's like red and green. Um, and then I have this one from last year that's like pink and has Christmas trees, although that doesn't really match with the rest of them. Whatever, I'll use that. Anyway. Oh, I also have this one. I forgot, which is. The same pink one, but just brown instead. So I'm gonna start wrapping. I would like to get these all done, ideally, like right now. Um, and then I actually have my sister's Christmas party tonight, so we're gonna go to that. But I need to pick up an ornament for that because there's like an ornament gift exchange or ornament exchange. So I need to run to the store and grab an ornament because I looked yesterday at Target and did not like any that I was finding. So. I need to do that. It's 1.30. Let's see if I can have this done by... Do you think I can have it done by 2? That would be ideal. Let's see. We'll see what happens. stocking stuffers here there's quite a bit so I'm gonna throw them in his stocking which he accidentally put my okay I'm breaking stuff he accidentally put my stocking stuffers in his stocking so I need to switch that and then I didn't wrap the clothing I'll do that separately and I'll throw that under the tree I was filming a TikTok while I was doing all this as well and so I just filmed like me putting the oh my god the presents in the stocking and I have a feeling that I'm not gonna be able to A, fit everything, but that it might be too heavy for this weight because it's fallen multiple times. So I'm gonna try, but there's a good chance I might, oh my God, this stocking keeps falling off. There's a good chance I might have to put a decent amount of the stocking stuffers under the tree, which is fine, it doesn't really matter, but it's just giving me issue after issue, this freaking stocking. I'm like worried that Sully's gonna hit it and it's gonna fall and I don't want the weight to fall on his head. Keeps happening. So annoying. Can't wait to have a fireplace so we can actually hang these properly because this just doesn't work like ever. Actually, you know what? I'll put that back up after. All right, I'm gonna leave it like that. It's gonna be too heavy, I think, as it is. This makes me nervous. 
I think it's okay. All right, let's hope that stays. Now that that is done, I'm gonna head out. I'm gonna grab the ornament that I need to grab. And then um, I'm also making a like sour cream and onion type dip for tonight. And Yusuf went to Target because he placed a pickup order. I don't know why I'm explaining this all, but they didn't have it. So I need to grab that as well. Before I go, it's probably only right though that we say happy birthday to Mr. Sullivan. I mean, I've already, we already sung to him literally, but. Mr. Birthday Boy. Mr. Three Year Old. Hi, sonnies. He's so cute. <laughs> I'll show you his uh, birthday cake that I made him. It's from this kit on Amazon. It's a peanut butter cake mix for dogs. And then it came with this like dog ice cream as well that I made and it's in the freezer now. And oh, there's frosting or icing, whatever I need to make in there as well. But the cake is super cute. It's in a little dog bone shape and it came with the ice cream, the cake. Actually came with candles too, which is I'm not sure about that. And uh, the dog bone like mold. So pretty good set. I can look it down below in case anyone is interested in spoiling their dogs for their birthday. But all right, let's go. I'm probably going to go to, I think, Publix and then TJ Maxx for an ornament. I think that's the plan. Sally, you want birthday cake? We're gonna give him the whole thing? No, I'm gonna cut a little piece. Oh. He'd be sick as hell. Sally, so blood your candle! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to Sullivan! Happy birthday, Mr. Puffley! Happy birthday to you! Yay! Okay, you want to have cake? Wait. I want to take picture first. Wait. Okay, now I have to. Eat. Wait. <laughs> hey, is that okay? I know, I know, I know, Bro. I know, but <laughs> he's like, stop teasing me. I don't want him to get sick. Should I do that? Yeah, that's fine. Are you gonna cut it more? Like, yeah. Little? Yeah. What are? What is that? Like, what are these? It's all really, really clean ingredients. There's like five, six ingredients in it. The. Oh, I think I just threw the box away. Mr. Birthday Boy. Okay, it is. 5.07, I'm gonna get the dip together for tonight. My camera will focus so that it's ready to go um, in a little bit. It's 5.06 right now and we need to leave here around six-ish. So I'm gonna do that. I got the onion dip mix. I think it's actually soup mix, soup and dip mix, whatever. All you have to do is mix this with a container of sour cream. So literally all I'm gonna do, the uh, box comes with two envelopes and you only need one. I'm trying to think if I have a bowl. I think it might just have to be like one of our regular bowls because this is too big and I have another one but I used it so it's in the dishwasher. So anyway, we're going to use this. I also did get um, an ornament which I'll show you in a little bit. I was having a hard time finding one to be honest. I think it's a little late in like the holiday season which is ridiculous because it's what, December 10th today but... I was having quite a hard time. So I got one from Target, which again, I'll show you. And then I didn't end up loving it. So there was like a Hallmark store nearby. So I ended up stopping in there and um, I found another one. Honestly, still don't really love that one, but I figured it was better than the one I found at Target. Also, my camera's gonna die. So that's great. This mix is like my childhood though. Like this dip, I mean because my mom used to make it for like, if I had like a little party or something with my friends, because it's so easy and it's so good, like ridiculously good. It doesn't look good, but you have this mix, you get some ruffles, easy little snack or appetizer, whatever, for like a get together. It's delish, I cannot wait. Actually, I honestly might put it in that glass bowl just because those bowls have lids. Probably easiest to transport it in that bowl rather than this but that is literally it it's done i am gonna put it in this bowl okay perfect oh we also did celebrate uh sully's birthday we gave him his cake we sang as you guys saw and that was super fun i know i didn't like talk before doing that but that was fun he loved his cake he devoured it so that's a good i mean he 
he devours anything. And that's what I do for me today. I'm looking crazy. I have a roller in my hair, shoes in my hand, but I just changed for the holiday party. I'm deciding to keep it casual. No surprise there. It's just who I am. I am. I am. Sully drinking water, as you can tell. I also did just take a clip of the ornament I'm bringing. Not my favorite, but it'll work. My camera's dying, so I have to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>